Hey guys, I can't stop here. And today I'm giving you guys Road to Second Lieutenant, and this is episode number two. Okay, now in this episode I'm doing an elimination of your rig in Jackson server with the M416 and the TPG run. Um, don't bag me if I do a little bit of spraying with it because, um, I was having a shitload of fraps lag when I was recording this and I needed to get this video out. And so, like, I couldn't really. I just started spraying to get. Because it was like. It was so laggy, you know, that shit. If you get what I'm saying. Now, in this video, I'm going to talk about keyloggers and something else. But yeah, well, lately, um, I made a new clan on my main called Toxic. Um, it's a search and destroy clan, also elimination clan, but yeah, we, um, uh, a lot of people would know my friend, Sickened. Yeah, well, he got keylogged and he didn't really do anything. He didn't download anything. He just got keylogged through, like, the Common Arms website. I presume, because it's the only way he could have got keylogged, because he didn't download, like, a fake NX generator that had, like, a keylogger in it, and all that shit, but, yeah, so, someone hacked his account, it's, like, flukely, like, I don't know how would they do it, but, like, they did it, and now he's lost his account, and it was a LTC3, and I presume that, lately, that, um, yeah, well, he, I reckon he got keylogged through the common arms, so, I was looking through the forums on the Common Arms website and someone posted, um, can you get keylogged through the Common Arms game and uh, GM, uh, GM Extreme or something like that posted back, no you can't, it's impossible and all that stuff, well, the GM was lying, he's a bullshitter, the little freaking dumb shit of a GM doesn't even know how to freaking get his game going, and now they're getting keylogged through Common Arms, so, they stuffed up the bloody game with keyloggers and most of us losing accounts and yeah so every day I've been logging in and like if you got Skype and you talk to your friends on Skype and all that shit that's the most easiest way they can keylog you they dito you or what um is like they they can't a dito you can't get keylog with it but um you like um they can turn off your internet like they like even though you don't turn like the modem off and all that stuff to like with the switch or through the PowerPoint, they like turn it off like through the um internet or whatever. So and also they like um they can like turn on your webcam if you have like a laptop or something. And they just do like shit on your computer, but they can't kill you. But like eventually, after a while, they after a while um they can kill you so they can get all your stats and all that shit. But if you want to not get keylogged, so if you think someone's going about to keylog you, or you feel like you accidentally downloaded, like, you accidentally went on a website and clicked download, but it, you didn't mean to, or something, like, you went on a website and, like, the download automatically started, and it's, like, a next generator, what it says, but it's actually a keylogger. All you really do is you go to your emails, and, um, you click on, um, where it says, like, or, uh, um, what does it say? But, um, it's like, oh, another email, so if you've got your email, they can, like, send a link to your other email, saying, like, here's your password, or, like, like to change your password. Because when they keylog you, they get, all they do is they get your, um, they get your common arms, and your email, like, stuff that you wrote. So, like, if you just got, like, a verification, or whatever, with your email, um, they can't, all you really do is you just go into your, um, email, and they, um, and you just change, and you just click send to the, um, other email. And then, like, you, you get the password and all that shit through the email. Then you change it, then you go back and you say that you've got your password and common arms, and then after a while, people probably have yeah, 10 minutes of work, you should have your account back. But always private security code on. And another thing I was thinking of is that, um, while talking on this subject, I reckon they should have, um, like... Like, um, if you guys have played Maple Story, when you go to log into your, like, character, you have to type in, like, a six-letter code. So, you, you have, like, a code, so, like, they can't, like, you click it, so you can't get keylogged. So, like, they can keylog you and get in your password. But before they log into your account, you have to, like, type in your password with, like, like clicking, so you can't get, like, keylogged. You get, like, well, it's click log. If, uh, I don't think that exists, but, yeah. So that's a little nifty thing. Common arms should put in their thing just to save people hacking the accounts and yeah. And another thing, um, I don't know really what they should do, but um, there's this new, there's this thing yeah, and um, they did an update p 
probably yesterday, day before, and it was like a f hour update. It was about like two, three o'clock in the morning for Australia, and um, it went for about forty-five minutes, and they didn't do anything. And they say they and p on the forums they said they patch hacks and all that shit. And if you go and I'm um, and then I think to myself, no, they don't because. I went straight into a game straight away and they started hacking, like a dude started hacking. And they did a 45 minute patch on hackers, but apparently they weren't. Um, they apparently, they were um, giving out people Linux for people that have been keylogged. So like when people are getting keylogged, they're um, getting like... They're sending in tickets like on like alt and all that shit, saying that I got hacked and um... Can you please send my username and password and all that shit to my email? Because, like, they have the history of your email, so, like, they send it to you. And, um, so they do it. But, yeah, they actually, and they say, like, stuff have been sold back and all that stuff. They give them, like, how much amount of NX has been sold back. Like, some dude got hacked. He got a perm Valkyrie and a, um, perm CQB sold back, and he ended up getting 50k NX. He didn't buy the two guns again, but he just got 50k NX back. But that's what they were doing. They were giving back NX. It was stupid, because I was just... Giving out free next to whoever was just making up bullshit and sending tickets and they got hacked. What anyone could do, but yeah. Um. So yeah, that's that's really all I had to really talk about is keyloggers because my friend got keylogged. He lost his account, and I just wanted to tell you guys that do not download NX generators, anything that isn't um on like a comment on the Common Arms website. Nothing like you think or. I I want to get NX. Just go and you go on like YouTube and you say, "Oh, free NX generator." Download it. A couple seconds later, yo, you keylogged everything that you've been working on has been just gone. It's like boom, gone. In fact, they can take your credit cards and that shit. So just giving you guys a warning: do not download anything. Like people say, CA cleaners. What well, means like they think that like they get in um get rid of their leg, but actually you can another keylogger. Everything that is. Do the next one these days is keylogging. So yeah, um, this game I th I pretty I went pretty shit because I got massive lag and lag spikes. But yeah, I went alright. Um, so I tried new fraps, tried new type of fraps in, and yeah, it sort of worked. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy this video. Um, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And yeah, so I can stop here and I'm out. Bye.